Hey peeps, welcome back to another episode of Lemon, last month in a nutshell, where I give you all the insights to all my numbers as a freelancer regarding what I earn, how much I have created content and how much followers I earned by that and everything around it. So stick with me and let's have a look at the numbers for August. Now you can see that I have increased in the posts or amount of posts on Instagram to 12 in comparison to eight for August. I have only posted one video on YouTube, which is the lemon video. And this will not change for September all that much because I have uh, for that month only shifted my focus. I, I wanted to share with you that I wanted to write a book about Swift for so long. And I always prioritized other things such as app development, website development and all the cool stuff and YouTube and so on. And it's great and it's working out pretty good articles and so on. But I never came to write a book and have that run in parallel. That's why I said for September for this month, I'm going to pause everything and focus purely on the book alongside of freelance projects, because that's where the money comes from. And so I have to protest that one like at the top always. Anyway, Swift UI is the book that I'm writing right now. Beginner edition, intermediate in advance is coming afterwards too. But at the end of this month, I'm writing, I'm finishing the book and publishing it. And then I can come back to all the other stuff. And then that book is online and runs in parallel, right? That's the thing I wanted to achieve. So that's why not as that much will change for YouTube on for September, but afterwards. So continuing with Twitter, I have only posted five tweets on Twitter and I'm not sure I will continue tracking it because it's not as much effort to post on Twitter than on YouTube, right? Uh, or Instagram. And um, yeah, maybe I'm not sure because I don't think people follow me because of the content on Twitter I'm posting, but more because of all the other content I'm creating and I'm linking Twitter <laughs> on these platforms. So let's see. Medium, I haven't posted any new article there and Patreon, I haven't posted anything there either. So let's go to the follower uh, tab. I have earned or I have uh, gained 166 followers during August, the whole month, which is just 10% from the previous month, as you can see, although I have increased in content creation. So what is that? What is happening? So as you can see, uh, or that is actually proof that Instagram punishments do exist. And I think I'm still or again in such a punishment. And I'm not sure why, because I really don't do anything against the guidelines. I really do everything by my bare hands with sweat and blood and hours of work, like write every comment, uh, answer all the DMs, like or follow other profiles genuinely and um, stuff like that. So not sure. I, I, I just think the algorithms aren't perfect. People are not perfect. And you just land there once in a while. And that's just something you will have to run with. And you get out there just like that and everything comes back to normal, which is then like a miracle. If that happens, you just um, get overwhelmed by the increase, by the instant increase of followers again. But um, by, while maintaining the same content creation <laughs> amount, right? But yeah, um, so you know that there is like a sinus curve. It goes up and down and you just go with it because at the end, you're still growing, you're still doing your stuff, right? Anyway, on YouTube, I've grown 120 uh, subscribers. I think that is because of all the links that I'm spreading through the internet, right? Articles here, Instagram posts there, Twitter posts here, and so on. I think mainly because of the articles. I have 20,000 views on a, mainly, on a monthly basis on all my articles in summary, 20,000 views on a monthly basis. And my links to Twitter, Instagram, and YouTube are there, are in those articles. So I think that's a constant uh, income of people, so to say. Anyway, so I think that's the same reason why I grow on Twitter and Medium right now in a constant manner. Oh, I didn't want to change the, the formula and uh, zero new patrons. Actually, I think I've uh, gained one more patron and I have lost one patron. So it's seven still. And now let's come to the income tab or pain. So I have earned about 4,000 euros during August and September this month is going to be interesting too. And the main income comes from freelance work. I have had uh, one client uh, where the 
majority money the majority of the money comes from like about 2800 and i had a small side project where i just earned about 70 years or something something in that range and uh, that sounds a lot uh, um, alongside the government 1100 which is happening just one more time for next month and then it's over and um, oh yeah i also wrote a new feature for my social down app you can uh, look in the description to find the link to the app it's an uh, instagram assistant to help you uh, use instagram more efficiently and keep track on your progress so i wrote a new feature for that for the inner purchase and so it drove the inner purchase a little bit up so that's why i earned 26 euros for that and i sold one more shirt and i have had one more patron uh, of a higher tier that's why i have six star six euros more here and in summary 113 so that sounds a lot right for one month four thousand that sounds whoa that's a lot of money but you have to keep in mind that um as a freelancer you don't know what the next month brings right um will you find a client will you have enough money and so all i do right now is since i don't have any expenses all that much and i decrease all my expenses to the minimum as possible to still maintain a um at the same time high productivity uh, on a daily basis in regards of um, not wasting time on useless stuff i have only 1100 euro in expenses every month so that means my the government money covers actually my expenses and everything additional i'm just stacking on another account on another bank account and i'm doing the and i'm doing the same for september too and so i will have ever i will just like always just pay like 1100 euro which is 650 for my rent and about 500 euro for food bills and going out to the cinema meeting some friends i don't know fritz cola mm. that's about it and i'm i'm living like a happy life with that money so i don't need that much although i think 1100 is already pretty much or quite a lot so uh, stacking up their money and potentially using it as an investment in the future and i will let you know about that too on that channel on instagram if you want to follow me look in the description and um let's have a look find a look on social blade in comparison to last video uh so social blade predicts that i will have 18,000 subscribers on youtube by 2024 which is um still a lot if you consider i currently only post one video a month uh, that's not the goal at all for, of mine, right? I want to have like 20,000 by the end of this year. I don't know. What, no, that's not possible. I'm not sure. Let's see. Uh, depending on how much I will focus on YouTube after this month, after finishing the book. So in comparison to Last Lemon, it actually decreases by 2,000, um, right? August, this is September, but still like <laughs> 2,000 less um, subscribers on YouTube as a prediction in the next five years because of the current situation of YouTube content on my site. I hope that was interesting for you. If you have any questions or if you want more insights, if you have any idea how much more I can be transparent towards you because I'm just inclined to share everything. I don't see the point of hiding away anything, right? So let me know in the comment section. Also subscribe to not miss out on the future Lemon episodes and everything else I'm planning to do alongside the tutorials. And uh, I see you in the next one. Bye.